So here's the challenge you face. Your best guess is that between 15 to 20 percent of your servers are underutilized or unused, consuming electricity without adding value to the business. Maybe the applications have been migrated to virtual servers, or M&A activities have shifted operations. For whatever the reason, servers that were once useful are now dead weight. They need to be removed to save power and free up rack space. The problem? You don't know where they are. Fortunately, iTrack CPIM lets you search for any servers based on any criteria you put into the system. End of lease, business unit, model, CPU utilization, or any other drill down you'd like. Adding CPU utilization to the real-time power readings from Intel, we search to confirm which servers have consistently low CPU and memory activity. We find a host of servers in which no business applications are running. The boxes are essentially unused. We drill down into the power usage of each server and to confirm the CPUs are vastly underutilized. But the question remains, why? We run a line of business search and it confirms that the business unit was dissolved months ago and the applications were migrated elsewhere, but no one turned off the servers, so now it's time to shut them down. We run a connectivity trace across the infrastructure to make sure there are no potential problems downstream, and it looks like there will be no problems. So we walk through a step-by-step -step sequence for decommissioning. A summary report is submitted to the change board identifying power cost savings and requesting permission to decommission. Approval is granted. The servers are removed and placed in inventory for other business units to repurpose. And the bottom line is a big one. We have 15% more rack space available to expand capacity. We've reduced our energy consumption and costs and we're obtaining the same business output at a lower overall power usage. To learn more, visit www.itrax.com.